Who are you looking forward to seeing here? Donald Trump. You're fucking kidding me. <laughs> I, was, I respect him. I like really? him. Really? He started talking about the whole, all that birther stuff when he was like, oh, I think Obama was born yeah, in. Yeah, he kind of, you know, I mean, yeah, I mean, he kind of took a big bite there. Yeah. <laughs> the Trans-Pacific Partnership is one of these so-called trade deals. I don't think we should be merging our economy okay. with countries like Vietnam and Malaysia and Brunei, the Sultan of Brunei, who's got, I think, 10 blonde wives, but they're all ruled Not by bad. Sharia law. I mean, <laughs> my wife doesn't watch TV. I, okay. keep her, I keep her in the basement. That's, that's smart. Um, that's smart. Give us the elevator pitch of why Karl Rove is history's greatest monster. Why well, is history? Well, how about history's most overrated guru? Uh, no, we had Dick Morris was, spoke this morning. How often are you called a cultist, and how do you respond to when, when people do call you some mad Randian cultist? When people call me a cultist, mm -hmm. which not very many people do anymore. I wasn't calling you a cultist. I was saying I that's that. what other people I know, call you. I know you are. <laughs> that's what our cameraman calls you. I have my personal views, but you know, you're, you're interviewing me as an advocate. <laughs> also, <laughs> Let's get the fuck out of here. <laughs> that was scary. I think that was a pallet. I, I, I don't think it was an NRA member. That's, I could have been like a, you know, someone dropped a gun or something. <laughs>